Hey guys, it's your boy Mac11 Gaming here, and today the EA has just released a new uh, video of the FIFA World Cup, which is an expansion of FIFA 14 Ultimate Team, and uh, we're just gonna break down this video. Here we go, guys, it's just 1 minute and 26 long, let's go. World Cup Fever is here, and for the first time ever, FIFA Ultimate Team is part of the excitement. Okay. So, what was the point of making an, a new game to make everybody spend money? They made us buy a new game, the FIFA World Cup, and then they release an update on the Ultimate Team, on the regular FIFA 14. Well, I mean, EA is just there to make money. Let's carry on. Available as an automatic download on May 29th, we're bringing new World Cup content and tournaments to FIFA 14's most popular game mode. Okay, so it's just a download and it's free, apparently. Uh, just a download. And it's, it looks like it's going to be a part from uh, the Ultimate Team. Build a squad with players from all 32 national teams taking part in Brazil. That's all the players, all the kits, the official match ball, and the Estadio de Maracanã. They'll all be available in packs as soon as you download the update. Okay, so we've got an update and they give you packs. And uh, the new design of the cards looks good. So, but how... Okay, so le let's carry on. So, we, we have to open packs. In FIFA 14 Ultimate Team World Cup, you can play online or single player in a tournament mode. The mode includes the full tournament from group to knockout stages and of course, the final. That's cool. To give you a taste of the atmosphere in Brazil, we've also added some visual changes, giving you an authentic World Cup presentation and theme. And there's a new chemistry system based on the player's nationality. Oh god, don't get EA on chemistry stuff. ...and the governing confederation. Everyone gets a starter pack with players, a badge and kits from your supported nation. And you can compete for the trophy right away. Improve your team and make them World Cup contenders by getting new players and consumables from the FUT World Cup store. The ad What? So, you've got to get from the World Cup store. Those are unique, untradeable, and can only be found in World Cup packs. Untradeable? To keep the tournament as authentic as possible, you won't be able to bring your current squads to the FUT World Cup experience. But there is no need to worry about your existing FUT squad. Every World Cup pack will also contain a free gold pack. Okay, so we can basically, in every pack we open, we're going to find the free gold pack for our normal uh, regular ultimate team which is apart from this and the only way to get consumables and players is to open pack so why did they say it was free download at the beginning they're making money anyway at the end of the day aren't they just um, let's carry on to be used outside of the world cup experience the fat world cup fun starts may 29th make sure you don't miss out Okay, so there we go guys, as you can see it's on all consoles, so yeah, uh, the download is on the 29th, but it looks good, but the fact you can't trade, which is, I think is one of, it's everything, all Ultimate Team is around that, and now you can't trade, so I don't know what's the point about that, I mean, they said it was free, download, okay, the download is free, but then you're, you're, you have to spend money to get good players and packs because you go and buy it on the market because there's no market so I think your um, coins and um, uh, FIFA points transfer from your normal ultimate team to uh, this thing and uh, um, I will about downloading it and trying it out so I don't know we'll just have to wait and see but I know, I'm not sure if how it's gonna be easy if if what if you find a shit pack you then you have to go and spend the money and open enough pack then that's a shit pack and you have to spend another to get another pack and that's another shit pack and then you have to open another one I mean if you never get good players you're just spending money for nothing you're not got you're not even gonna play what if you find open two packs and get two messies I mean the first one you have to keep the second one you have to discard Messi discard Messi like if there was a market I don't know I think they're doing something wrong because I think they should have put the market in
because you could have made some money or maybe a quick sell but no they're untradeable so if you quick sell a player they give you no coins maybe so well that's what EA is giving us today but it's nice to see something new you know so yeah guys that's the breakdown and um, I'll be seeing you soon for more updates on this it's been your boy Matalain Gaming until next time see ya